Good morning, Bobcats. I just wanted to take a second to say thank you for an incredible Hope Week. The, the amount of costumes that we saw this week, the quality, the creativity of the costume, it's amazing. Way to embrace the dress up days. Remember the purpose of our Hope Week is to do just that, to introduce more hope into the school. This is an incredible school. And the truth is, I haven't been many places that are better than this. And I believe that we can make it even better by making the school more positive. So let's take advantage of this moment, this, this week that we've had, to change the way that we think a little bit going forward. Rather than taking cheap shots to get a good laugh uh, at, from somebody, instead, let's choose to be positive. Be kind to find the people that are by themselves and invite them to hang out with us. Let's embrace everyone in the school because the truth is we're all part of a family and every person in this family matters. Hope Week is all about recognizing that we're all different and that's fantastic. So that's all I'm gonna say. I know that you don't wanna see my face, you wanna see prizes. So we're gonna take a second and let one of our Hope Squad members, Sadie Kerbs, and Mrs. Chase go through the drawing to introduce your prizes. Good luck. All right, let's draw some names for our big prizes and from our raffle this week. The first uh, prize that we're giving away is a $5 gift card to Crumble Cookie. You wanna draw? And the prize goes to Logan Red in ninth grade. Okay, we're gonna draw another crumble cookie. So, $5 crumble. I'm all good off. Jenna Nelson in eighth grade. Oh, yay. <laughs> okay, another uh, crumble cookie, $5 gift card. Sadie. Mason Cottle in seventh grade. All right, and one, mm, nope, that was all the Crumble gift cards. All right, and now we have a $25 Fat Cats gift card. And the winner is? John Kelly in eighth grade. And we have one other Fat Cat gift card for $25. Cameron Stromberg in the ninth grade. All right, what do we got next? Um, we have a big bag of M&Ms. <laughs> <laughs> okay. A giant bag of M&Ms and the winner is? Lucas Spaulding in ninth grade. Very good, all right, let's do uh, Butterfingers, a big giant bag of Butterfingers. And the winner is Ella Westergaard in eighth grade. Hey, uh, Swedish fish? <laughs> hey, Swedish fish, go for it. Lydia Lake in the ninth grade. All right, another bag of M&Ms. <laughs> Carson Gibson in seventh grade. All right. Uh, and I have one more bag of M&Ms over here. Ripken Kessler in eighth grade. All right. One more bag of Swedish fish. Yep. Oh, I think, did I just draw? Did you just draw? I can't remember. <laughs> Reese Meredith in seventh grade. Okay. Uh, okay, so the next big prize we don't have with us, but it is a custom built chessboard uh, made by Miss Gee's dad, Mr. Gee. <laughs> and it has Boise State colors on it, blue and orange, and it has a value of over $300. So this one's a pretty cool gift. Sadie, do the honors. All right. Calvin Myers in ninth grade. 
All right, Calvin Myers in ninth grade, you get the chessboard. All right. Now we have some AirPods. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and the winner is? Carter Christensen in seventh grade. All right. And one last set of AirPods. Go ahead, Sadie. And the winner is Scarlett Maxwell in seventh grade. So that's all of our prizes. Thanks for participating, you guys. And thanks for all of the cool costumes and especially the acts that were so kind and, and um, good to each other. So. Mm-hmm.